Welcome back to K1 World Grand Prix 2023 K Festa 6. Uh, I'm Russell Goodall. And Nicholas Pettis. I think we've got a K1 under 62 kg catchweight fight. This is between uh, Tatsuya Oiwa versus yeah. uh, Yuta Kuni Eda. Actually, uh, Oiwa was going to fight uh, Ozawa Kaito. Last minute that he was uh, injured three days ago, so Yuta Kuni Eda is stepping in at very short oh, notice. Oh, there's Nuno Pettis. There he is. Yeah, and <laughs> another Pettis looking on. The champ. Yeah, the champ. <laughs> Uh, as uh, on this uh, K1 under 62 kg catch weight, Let's see what uh, Oiwa can do in this uh, fight. He, but he didn't bring the chains in, obviously, into the ring there. As seen in this photo, Kunida, we've seen his face before, and he's, he's uh, fought with a crush in K1. Let's see. Uh, good for him for stepping up in three days' notice. Oh yeah, three days. Yeah. <laughs> Both at 168 centimeters and about the same age at 30 and 31. I feel like Oiwa is uh, actually like a, a guy that just wants to go in there and punch it up. Mm. <laughs> Sussing out each other here in round one. Mm. Mm. Nice. Okay, yeah. Like I said, he just wants to go in there and punch it up. <laughs> he means business. Well, he's got really heavy hands for this weight class. Mm. He keeps going like that. Good body shot there. Mm. I don't know, I feel like this is like Oiwa's pace somehow. I mean, clearly he's putting a lot of pressure on him. But there's something about like the, the feeling of the match that it's going to go in his favor. Oh yeah, definitely, yeah. Yeah, I, I don't know why, but it just looks like that. There's something about his confidence. Mm. I, exactly yes. what I'm talking about. There we go. He almost had him with that. Almost. We do see that determination in all his eyes, but uh, let's see if Kunida can make that any more difficult. Kunida's also got that like stiffer upper body that doesn't move, very ah. flexible. So when he does take a hit, he takes it hard. Hey, like that, yeah. Okay. Oh, he must be questioning himself right now. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Okay, looking a little worried, big thing in but okay. Nice calf. Kick. from the audience there. Oh, yeah. Whoa, sneaky. That was actually good. Oh, oh my gosh. That's, that's a couple of seconds. Oh my gosh. Watch out for me there. Oh no, oh! Yeah! Whoa! Yeah. Oh. Oh. Man! By the bell. Okay. Almost. Yeah. Almost. Man, Yuta Kunihira, what a warrior. He took some big bombs there. Okay, I thought it was going to be over. Well, the, the, the round and the, and the fight, but... Uh, but we'll see more in the round two. Well, that was oh, definitely exciting. What, did all you almost have him there, Nick? I think so. Yeah. Yeah. I think he did get hurt. But he was actually, he was standing there taking it and fighting it back, so. Yeah. That's when we thought it was going to end there in, um, well, with the bow. But uh, the kind of survived. It's funny how you get the last 10 seconds and stuff like that happens. Oh. And it yeah. can change the rest of the whole fight, yeah. you know? Because you're thinking it's almost over like that. Yeah, but imagine if they'd started the fight like that. Mm. You know, it's right at the last 10 seconds, anything can happen. Right into round two. This, I, think that's like, I think that was Takeda again, was it? That was, one, you know, one was I was trying to figure out what the 17 yeah. live was. That was that's just another sponsor there. Okay. Oh. Here we go. Who knew that? I mean, they are just going straight into this. Oh, 
Now, what were you thinking? He almost had, had him at the end of round one. Mm. Coming back. The jab connected straight in his face. I see what you mean by Kuni, the stiff upper body. Yeah. yeah. Doesn't have a lot of movement in it. He's mm. standing very upright. Which is uh, good for having a long jab, as you can see. Ah. I'm not really feeling that he's taking advantage of that upright position, though. Yeah. Ooh. See, there's just something about his confidence, Oyo. It just feels like it's his, it, it, it mm. his, his fight. Mm. Mm. Ooh. Is Kunita sick in the flight? Yeah. Ooh. Man, these punches. They're hurting me from the other side of the screen. <laughs> you can hear it, can't you? Ooh. Breathe. Breathe. Oh, and there you have it. There you have it. That was just a question of time. And I was thinking we're going to get uh, another nice round and a half. Wow. That's the way you are. Definitely that confidence you, can, you saw and we are seeing now in this case. <laughs> yeah. It's like, you love me. I know you love me. <laughs> nice. Uh, Cook in. Halfway through the round two there. But I like what Kunita was doing too. Yeah. Mm. Yeah, but there was there was just something about it. Yeah. It was bound to happen. We saw what we were. Uh, and there's a... Good for him, actually. That was yeah. a great fight. There's the chain. <laughs> there's the chain uh, that was put on his neck by uh, Takeru. By oh. Yeah. Whoa. Maybe he trains with that chain on to, you know, to keep, <laughs> keep that weight. Whoa. Wow. He actually was in the air there. Ah, uh, yeah. that just before we landed. Boom! Oh. Wow. I don't know why, but he pulls that chain off really well. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> if yeah. I was be standing around with a chain on, you would just laugh. <laughs> yeah, that, it does suit him, yeah. It must be the right size. I don't know what it is. I that this trophy might get a speech from him. This is still enough knockout. Moment. That's great, he's not even sweating. Mm. <laughs> yeah. One and a half rounds, yeah. And that would be counting as his number eight knockout by win. Yeah, in the pretty third one. It is uh, Takeru in this corner We're looking on. There he is. Let's see how we さりふかしました。わあ。<笑><笑> え、こうやって選手全員この試合に、え、出場できて、試合ができて、今こうやって皆さんの前で試合ができます。え、本当皆さんにありがとうございます。えっと、戦いたいなと思います。え、やっぱり軽ワンは倒して細野軽ワンだと思ってます。え、それを今日ま最低限クリアできたと思ってます。え、これからもどんどんどんどん倒してあの、僕が軽ワン軽ワンを目指せたっ